my gosh. This is freaking so rad. Do you have no idea? This is so rad. A uh, little backstory, no backstory. I've been wanting these for quite some time. It's been almost a year now since I've wanted my own. And you know, a lot of people made fun of me and all that. Not a lot, actually, but I'm just really, I'm really excited. Um, this is gonna help out with my fitness. Um, it's gonna look really bizarre, but I don't care. All right, here we go. It's upside down. Oh no, oh no, what could this possibly be? Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, this is a great unboxing. Oh, you can, you can see it now. Oh, you can see it. I have, I have now acquired the Rydell Crew skates. I cannot wait. Oh my God. I'm just looking at the camera. Screw the camera. Dude, this is, this is, wow. Dude, this is some quality. I mean, this is not a joke. Right off the bat, they're, well, I don't know anything about, I used to skateboard. I know about skateboards and bushings and wheels and, and trucks and all that. But let's, let's, let's figure this out. It comes with a skate key, which is uh, neat, but I already have one for skateboarding, which would work just as fine. Oh my gosh. No, you can't see my face because I have an awkward camera set up, but I am smiling for the most part. Now, I, don't, I can't give you like a, a proper review like the pros, like the normal people that do roller skating. I don't know anything about it other than I enjoy it. I've been out to the rink. Wow, these are pretty stiff too. Okay, my first impression of, of me being a noob too. Nope, I can't fold it over. That's a damn good stiff boot. I think this will cut my ankle up. I don't know. Looks like there's good padding right here. It sort of digs in a little bit. Really good padding inside of here. The tongue has got some really good padding. Also, it's not it's not very pliable. It's pretty stiff. This tongue is, you know, it could launch a quarter out of it. Dude. I need to read it for you. I hope this fits. Oh my. Crazy. Dude. There's a damn block in here. Like wedged in here. Now let's do an initial equipment test. Toe stopper's adjustable. This is super important. And then the base plate, it looks like it's slightly arced. Like, like uh, bolted and it's under, under strain. This is not meant for park skating. It will crack. This is a durable, hard ABS, I believe. The only downside to these trucks are they're not, it's not a double adjustable, but you can work with that. As long as you can adjust your trucks, take out your grommets. But it's nice to actually have a nut in the bottom so you can, uh, you know, double compress and tweak. You can kind of see my, my boot. I'm gonna break them in a little bit. Wear them around the house, you know, take out the trash. Hardware looks good. Lock nuts, or lock washers, I mean. I'm not even gonna spin the wheels yet. Oh my gosh, this is freaking so rad. You have no idea, this is so rad. Don't know what kind of trucks those are. They look decent. They're a, a cast aluminum with obviously a steel um, axle. Now let's do a wheel test. Oh, it's the same truck as the, the, the base plate. The base plate has an eight on it. 
that's not for the size because it does look like it's small for the food. But that's fine, that's fine. But my concern is, I don't have any concerns. Wheels. They'll never spin perfect off the bat. They just can't. They're not, they put them together so there's no play in the, the axles. People say you, you never should have play in your, your uh, axles. As a skateboarder, and uh, I wanted a little bit more performance, I would have a little bit of slack, but that's just me. You can prematurely wear out your bearings that way. Do an inspection on these bearings. Yep, it's like a rubber or a plastic. No biggie, those will eventually be changed. It's not like I'm, I'm gonna be doing anything fancy. The, the wheels are an 85A, which is, 85A is relatively soft, 101, a 104A are hard wheels, um, but yeah, this this is going to be interesting. They got some grip. I'm not going to mess with anything. Um, the trucks are super tight, but that's that's probably good for now. We're not going to mess with any of that stuff yet. This is a simple stamped tool. There's your toe stop. Remember, this tightens it. So you're gonna loosen that nut, then you can un unthread your toe stop. You can set the height, not, not too much, because it's basically usually in one spot. Then you can tighten it by reverse threading so it can increase your tension. Then you got your axles. It's kind of clever, uh, fits the cup of the wheel. Then you have your trucks, pretty neat. The glue and the toe look pretty good. This is the main toe seam. Don't want to split that. It's a very rugged, rugged boot. I mean, I'm going to put this on um, in a second. I'm going to have to pause the video. Oh, it even has, I didn't know this. This logo is like a almost almost like a brass that's nailed into the sole. The sole isn't, it, to me it looks like a plastic. Maybe a nylon or something. Because normally uh, those shoes are stacked leather, you know. But that's fine, it's, it's, I wanted an outdoor. Remember, all skates can be indoor, outdoor. Just change your wheels. This is the dumb, this is the dumb move. If I fall right on my ass. Helmet. Oh yeah, this is this this is rough. My neighbors are gonna laugh at me. And uh, yes, this this boot doesn't look like leather. It looks like vinyl. I don't know. It's, whatever. I'm I'm content. Okay. So, what do I think of this? I have no freaking clue. Let's put them on. The quality is really good. I must say. Um, I'm used to buying cheap shoe, shoe apparel, you know. I mean, for crying out loud, this is my every, this is my going to town rig right here. My going to town rig. Same thing with the other side. A little stiff because I have a, I have a huge block foot. Like my, my feet are very, very wide. So it's a miracle that these even fit the way they do. So this immediately is starting to cut into the back of my, uh, my uh, cankle. I didn't even loosen the bearings. This is, this is far out, man. Oh my God. This is so freaking sweet. Dude. Oh my gosh, man. I could practice, um, Balancing and stuff, just wearing these. Be able to get my cardio in. This is, oh man, I, I'm, I'm sorry. I, I'm actually pretty, I'm pretty, I'm pretty happy about this. Like, I don't know how to describe it. I just love, I love skates, dude. They're pretty freaking, uh, yeah, I'm not, I'm not on a, a rink or outside or anything, but... Yeah. 
so I can't say, oh, here, these are my first impressions. Guess what I'm gonna have to do is walk up the stairs with them. Walking up the stairs. Is this safe? This is what I've seen in the videos. You walk like a penguin. I mean, I'm sure this is not smart. I've never done this before. Oh, no, I'm gonna go sideways. <clears throat> Maybe I'm doing it wrong. All right, let's see what I feel. Looks like there's a pole on the trucks. Hang on a second. Maybe they just gotta break them in. Oh my gosh. My dog's never seen me. This is amazing. <laughs> this is this is rad. What's up, Katarina? What do you think? What? What is it? What is it? Want some roller skates? So yeah, <clears throat> this is neat. Just by moving around just a little bit, you know. Whoa, these things are fast. Ugh, yeah. I don't know if I'm gonna go outside with them because it's kind of raining. Well, I do need to practice balancing and falling and all that, but the extra grip, these things really do have Good grip on this part before. What's going on? What's going on? Okay, thanks for watching. Yep, I guess that's the end of this video. Thanks for watching. I know it was probably weird and not that great because I don't make videos like this. I normally make boring electronics videos. Yes, that's what I do. I do that. You know, the crystal radio thing. With that being said, I hope you enjoyed the video, bye. Okay, I'm gonna record myself going, going down the stairs. How I go down the stairs Hmm, don't know. This is the scary part, I think. Because I'm under the impression my foot's gonna shoot out like that. This is bad. Dude, how the hell do you do this? Very carefully. Nope. Definitely not 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 very I don't I have zero confidence in doing this right now. <laughs>